Guys, if you haven't yet, then subscribe to my channel and press the bell icon and never miss a video from Tech of Friendly. Hello guys, once again welcome to Tech of Friendly. Today I am going to show you guys how to or flash any Android phone. So guys, uh, uh, many uh, many of the circumstances uh, when your uh, phone are uh, stuck at boot screen or like uh, your phone are dead uh, or your phone have gone into a, a boot boot loop mode. All right. So today I'm going to show you how you can uh, flash any Android phone easily within a few simple steps. So without any delay, let's get started. So first of all, what you have to do is uh, you have to uh, download this SP Flash tool. I will put the download link in the description below. All right. So after that, what you have to do is head over to this website firmwarefile.com because you have to uh, download the stock ROM or the firmware file uh, in order to flash your phone. So head head over to this website firmwarefile.com. Uh, I will put the description in the. Uh, uh, I will put the download link in the description below. So uh, after downloading uh, stock uh, this SP Flash tool, and uh, search your phones, uh, search the firmware for your mobile phone in this search bar by putting the or typing in the model number of your phone so i am today i'm going to flash uh, carbon a6 turbo so i'm gonna put here carbon so here it is uh, i have searched it already so i'll go for it and press enter so here it is guys uh, two options i will head over to carbon a6 turbo and download the latest firmware uh, file all right uh, latest flash file so uh, just uh, click on it and download it all right so download anyway so i i have downloaded it already here it is so uh, guys when you download the firmware file from this site firmwarefile.com uh, chances is that most of the times you will get the uh, fla uh, you know flash tool in this file itself all right this uh, this is not uh, this comes with a flash tool most of the times when you uh, download the firmware from from the from that site uh, it comes with a flash tool all right so uh, we will uh, see if there it is there is a flash tool extract it over here so i am extracting it all right so just extract it all right so i have extracted this file over here look just as i said uh, you will get the flash tools there, there are two software uh, right here one is sp flash tool uh, the same i uh, which i told you earlier to download and sn write tool so uh, if you want to install or if you want to use this tool then it's okay good you can uh, use this or you want to use the tool that i have provided the link in uh, you can also use that so what you have to do is open the uh, you know file or uh, the tool that i provided the folder and uh, click on this flash tool.exe file double click on it and run it all right so just run it all right so what you have to do is now uh, in this download agent you have to browse and select this mtk all in one da dot bin you this file will be present when you download the firmware file for your phone all right so this thing uh, mtk all in one uh, dba dot bin uh, most in most of the cases you don't have to do that because uh, this sp tool file will automatically uh, you know uh, uh, this thing uh, 
uh, yeah, it, d, d, all in one DBA file in SP Flash tool. Uh, sorry, you have to uh, find that. All right. So all in one DF. Uh, most of the times, uh, this SP Flash tool will uh, uh, it will be uh, selected already. And what you have to do is you have to load this scatter loading file. All right. I'll I'll show you how to do it. Just click on it and. Uh, go to your browse to your uh, firmware file that you have downloaded so uh, i have downloaded it in my desktop all right so it's over here go to this and click on firmware there there will be a folder named firmware whenever you download the firmware file all right so in that firmware file for for sure hundred percent there will be a file named uh, this scatter dot text all right so click on this and open it all right so it has opened now uh, you are all set now what you have to do is you have to connect your phone uh, to the uh, to the computer so guys before connecting your phone make sure that your phone is having at least 15 percent uh, of charge and how you have to connect is you have to remove your battery of your phone and then connect your phone all right so uh, you have to remove the battery all right you, you can't do it with the battery uh, in, in your phone plugged into your phone all right so you have to remove your battery remove the battery of your phone and then connect your phone with a usb cable all right after connecting it just start on just click on download all right so as you can see over here it's it has started download or flashing see it is showing download flash and the percent so it is flashing your phone so we'll let it finish so guys this procedure is pretty much same for all android phones or all smartphones uh, you just have to head over to this website and download the st firmware or stock rom of your phone by putting your uh, phone name or model name in this search bar and it will show you uh, a zip file or firmware file that you have to download all right so most of the times you will get a flash tool inside that firm zip file that you download you can use that too or you can use this sp flash tool that i have uh, i have provided the download link i mean sp flash tool is very famous and this is very simple all right this is very handy tool you can flash any android device just you have to load this scatter loading file that comes with your firmware file that you download from that site all right so it has finished flashing my android device you know unplug your device or remove your dev device from your computer and put the battery back on all right so put the battery back so guys let's put the battery back on so let's put it back and turn it on by pressing the power button it will take some time to load depending depending on your device all right uh, it may take up to 10 minutes sometimes in many of the cases it takes more than 10 minutes uh, to load so don't worry just wait don't do anything else just wait till your phone loads or boots up so
let it finish so yeah yeah guys the system is back on all right so just go through the setup wizard just press ok on everything all right so close and so yeah guys as you can see the phone is back to normal so you can just open anything or the apps are all the so although all my data is gone so uh, you have to take a backup of whatever you are going to do all right so before doing this before flashing uh, your mobile you have to take a backup of everything every context and uh, uh, all the stuff all videos photos and everything uh, in a uh, in an external uh, disk or portable disk or just copy it to your computer or a memory card or something like that and do it because uh, all the date all the data all the contacts everything in your phone gets lost so that's it guys that's it that's how you can flash any android device so i hope you like my video if you like my video give me a thumbs up if you didn't like my video give me a thumbs down and guys if you have any doubt or anything if you uh, if you are not getting uh, the your phone's firmware file or anything like that just uh, put it down in the comment section below i will reply to you and i will try to help you guys all right so that's it uh, also check out my channel and if you like my content subscribe to me and uh, share this video to all your friends who have to uh, root or flash uh, flash their phone uh, so that's it guys that's it for today uh, see you guys in my next video uh, till then take care bye bye